hello everyone welcome back to the channel this is richard fixer so now today i am in my mixer and i have a few um mcu that didn't work from previous repairs that i just changed them um so i'm trying to um, reheat or reball this chip that's on this board and see if it works using my workstation uh, stay tuned all right, so I took out the MCU. I'm gonna just remove the chip right now. And this is the chip we're gonna be focusing on. I've, first of all, just wanna inspect the, the, the pins, but I went, I went through the pins and the pins are okay. Sometimes I think reballing this IC would um, allow it to work. Sometimes the solder joints, you know, they don't hold properly. So I'm gonna be using my workstation over here, my hot gun workstation to do this. So my workstation is on. I have the heat gun up to 350 and the air all the way to the max. So I'm gonna just be circulating this heat around this chip right here. Try not to let it stay one place. Once I allow it to cool, I'm gonna replace the chip and then I'm gonna reinsert it into the mixer. All right, so now the board is cool. I'm going to reinsert this chip and um, all right, and I'm going to be putting this board back in this mixer. All right, so I'm gonna to attempt to put this card back inside. Trying to get the slots aligned properly. I'm gonna push it down. All right, that's All right, push the back down. All right. All right, so let's turn the board on. Let's see what happens. All right, I see that change in the light. So it did work. Ah, it did work. So it should boot up right now. Good. So I have, uh, I have reballed this IC. So it's working. So it's working. All right. So I have two more parts here. That I'm gonna try with and um, one of these is mine originally and I did one yesterday we bought one yesterday so I'm gonna did I'm gonna do these two and see how they work out some light Set the camera down. Bum, bum. 
Everything is in the stack. Trying to power this on. Light. All right, this is not turning on. Let me check the SD card again. Make sure that it's perfectly fine. I'm gonna turn it back on and watch if there's any light. There's no light in this. As you have seen in the repair, not all the boards can be repaired using the method of reballing, of applying heat to this IC that's right here what can be done um i think that most of these chips sometimes if they are damaged um by a lightning or a power surge then it's a different sort of repair so just just a note just to point out that not all of these can be done by the same method my next attempt in repairing um this specific board is by replacing a chip that's on the board and that would be my upcoming video all right thank you for watching the video Please remember to like, share, subscribe, and comment. See you next time.